I ride Jay and Dale. So here's J.O. Again, okay. another impromptu thing pops <laughs> off. It just happens that way. So when you have two good beer reviewers in the same area, these oh, things tend yeah, to happen. Guys. But here we have all the horses. Well, not all of them. They're all still being lined up. Here's like four of the horses. And two back there getting Two are back up. there getting hooked up as well. We got two more in the Clyde still, man. Oh, man. The truck here, all the stuff taking this, this place. This is supposed to go to 5 o'clock, but they are running a little bit late. So um, they ran a little bit late, so they said they would stay, see about staying, as long as the horses do not get too cold. Here are all the people that are actually down here right now yeah. to see the Budweiser Clydesdale. Uh, Tons of people little family activity we have some kids out here i would think the kids would be in school but we just get hello hans welcome my friend yeah it looks like santa is going to get hammered for sure now down here they also have the um budweiser copper series on draft and i forgot the other one they have and i'm going to check out some beers from uh, inside as well for braxton labs at some point too hey there one sip you're jumping over from different streams from between me and J.O., huh? <laughs> yeah, check out this guy. Yeah, I told J.O. I was in a neighborhood and decided to swing over. Probably swing over to Darkness Brewing. That's where we were at, right down the street. Check them out at some point, too. But look how big these horses are. I love it how when they get in the place, they aren't even hooked up, but they just stand there. They just know their role. Yeah. Like the rock, know your role. That's what they're doing right now. Yeah, it does make for a nice adventure. I agree, one sip. I do agree. Oh, goodness, yes. <laughs> Maybe it'll be a new party source commercial with Budweiser. Who knows? I don't know. We'll find out. That'll get some recognition. Oh, look at that one. They're backing up one now oh, in the truck over here. That they're going to be bringing out so i think they're going to have a total of the eight horses uh my understanding is that budweiser these horses are really taken care of very well so here's one coming off the trailer going to be heading over here to get in line they're coming out now with some of the harnesses for the two they just brought out from over this way so there's more of an angle closer to the horses we'll definitely, uh... there's a party source in the background the sign we got yeah so they're all here, taking it all in. Look at the size of those feet. Those feet are massive. Those feet are huge. Teeth, indeed. You can see it. That's a good sized horse. That is. Um, the way I understand it, they are 13 to close to like 1,800 pounds. So they are well over a ton worth of horse there. Wow. And. I mean, you don't think about it, but that is a lot of strength and power right there. A lot of horsepower. <laughs> I wouldn't go in there. <laughs> Somebody said earlier, they said, um, what, uh, they were running late because they were low on horsepower. <laughs> uh, and, like, I'm not acknowledging that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's the one who told me that one. He told us that one there. He heard it from a customer. Oh, uh, they're bringing it up. Okay, so I think there's one more to unload after this one. It is a nice one. It is a nice type day to be out here. Kind of cool, kind of cold. 22 degrees or so. Yeah, <laughs> it freezing, is, as oh, noted. Is numb. Yeah, I know. I'm in gloves and my hands are just as numb as can be. I should have my hand in gloves, but every time I touch the screen, you can't do it with gloves. So. Oh, man. No, we cannot pet them yet. Hopefully, we will be able to pet them later, Jamie. There are some pretty horses, though. Uh, yeah. Um, I, uh, I, it's like, yeah, I really want to pet one of these things because they're just so beautiful. And just, just look at the regalness of this guy. He's been fit with a bridle right now. He's standing there in position, in 
Yeah, yeah, you're right, one sip. I need to get some tech gloves. Yeah. They would definitely help. I've what? seen them, but I haven't gotten them. Oh, baseball gloves? Other baseball gloves. Oh, oh. I have my old school I softball. Fine, yeah. I have my old softball gloves at home. They would have been nice. So what are they doing with the horses? Is it going to go? Emotional. They're probably going to parade them around, and there's going to be photo opportunities afterwards. Oh, okay. The line will be able to all these people are here. Okay. We had over 9,000 people. And honestly, what I find hilarious is uh, all the kids stand on the light connection. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, they're bringing out our last truck. Now, I'm not a truant officer or anything, but I would think the kids would have been in school today, but <laughs> I guess it's a holiday for Budweiser. Yeah. <laughs> big, massive event. Oh, what we got here? We got a little ambulance coming in now. <laughs> Hope nobody got hurt. <laughs> yeah. You can uh, get frostbit. You know, sometimes when it gets crowds like this, they have them on standby. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Say say hi to our guys again here. See you guys. Stop right. in and get some cigars. <laughs> See you doing? All right, man. We'll catch you later. <laughs> hey, you too. Nice to meet you. We're gonna hook up these glasses too. Cool. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and well, I'll wait for me to get the other ones in before I sign off here. But make sure you check out Jo's channel on the Party Source Review too who was gracious enough to bring me inside where I can actually get some shots like this for you. Does some good stuff on his channel. And thank you for the likes on there. Please make sure to hit that like button, of course. I mean, not just for me, but for YouTube. They tend to like it when people hit the like button. It kind of helps things out. So always remember to hit that like button. And remember to uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet so you'll catch all these good things as they come up. But there are some people there on the light post for sure. Unexpected surprise there with Rod swinging by. Hey, we came down, we were gonna get some beer. We might have get bourbon the way <laughs> stay out here for much longer. Oh, okay. I'm gonna point this out. Go on a new riff over there. And for five dollars, they are selling one of the best apple cider bourbons I've ever had. Apple cider bourbon. Absolutely phenomenal. I can definitely check that out. The horse is nodding his head in agreement. Yeah. That, now the other one is. I think they, they got an itch or something going on. Or they're just horsing around. Oh! oh. oh. Wait for the bad <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that was a terrible joke. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Jamie and the mom's laughing at that one. <laughs> And the horse is rolling their eyes at that one. Well, you know I'll nag you on well, jokes. Wait, 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 I'll nag you on the jokes. No, I, could, I could give you a horse laugh. Oh, oh. Uh, getting them hooked with their reins. I, I really want to see this thing in motion. Yeah. We've been live for 30 minutes, and it's just been awesome just seeing these. And the people have just been steady on it. Just seeing the horses getting hooked up. Yeah. Yeah, these two in the back, they got something going on here. Yeah, they're talking, they're, they're throwing jokes about humans, yeah. you know. Imagine they have human puns. <laughs> of course, nobody ever wants to be the back of the horse. I mean, the horse, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe they're, they're, compla the they're complaining, maybe. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Stinks back here. I always have to be back here. I want to be the front horse one day. Move up the line. <sighs> we got these two over here getting hooked up. Oh, there we go. All right. Just look at him. Just knowing where he's standing back here, nodding their head, probably. Maybe they're all too Yeah, maybe is what I was thinking. Something like, you know, they've not had those reins on, yeah. so trying to get it loose. And... But they put them on there to keep them focused, yeah. I just love it. This guy's in here working between them. One of those things steps on your foot, you are going to know it. Oh, it's going to be like a freaking Luke Cage punch to the chest. <laughs> no, Luke Cage. Luke Cage. Is he a Mortal Kombat? They added on that because he's a Marvel character. Oh, Luke so, I thought you were saying Luke Cage. 
Oh, Luke A. Oh, Luke A, Jasmine, yeah. yeah. yeah the, the they do put Marvel character characters in the games now, so you might be in there. <laughs> they put Jason Voorhees in one of those. Yeah, games. yeah. Okay, Rod is also a video gamer, so... Oh, yeah. yeah. Definitely got a game. Oh, man. This is like a horse simulation one right now, where you got to make sure your horses are pulling. So they brought them out of the trucks, and they brushed them. They all brass here on this wagon. They polished all the brass and onto the horse. I didn't notice the Christmas on the main. Oh, like yeah, the little have, uh, flowers, roses, yeah. Yeah, roses and their tails. Their tails have them too. Yeah. All right. Oh, look, they even have the Anheuser Busch Eagle on the blocks. I'll try and get uh, a oh, yeah. of that. Um, hang on, I, I don't know if I'll let you JO's going in close. On history so horses would show up for the annual parade and they would be marched down the streets of St. Louis normally with one of the uh, Anheuser Bushes driving or riding in in the carriage well. and later I'm gonna say it was the second um, second generation it ran for four generations before it got sold but the second generation he actually had one of the first ever campers and he had it driven down the main street of St. Louis, and he took, made sure to do this. This is uh, just the kind of man he was. He took a shower in the uh, actual shower in his uh, camper, and he uh, was reported to have laughed the entire time because he said nobody else has taken a shower while driving down the uh, Gar Fair City. Wow. J.O. dropping the knowledge. But uh, honestly, their history is one of some really cool scandals and some awesome, awesome frivolous yeah. money spending. It's oh, really, yeah. really cool. I've seen their brewery on yeah. Bar, um, Bar Rescue. I wouldn't mind going there from in St. Louis to check it oh, out. Bar Rescue, really? Yeah. I'd have to see that. Yeah, they went to the bar. They went there one time. They do. They did a bar out in St. Louis, and they didn't know how to pour a beer. Oh, and they didn't man. even serve Budweiser in the bar, and they're in St. Louis, so they took them to the Budweiser facility okay. and brewery. And okay, okay, it wasn't the Budweiser bar; it was just a bar. It was okay. a bar, but they had a Bud Light sign out. They had no Bud in there. I was like, I don't know how some of these bar owners are on Bar Rescue, but here's one of the craziest sights I'll see today. This lady over here, in between the trucks, she's in shorts. Oh, it's 22 God. degrees, and like a vest in her. I'm like, I'm a big guy. I'm like kind of cold out here, but she's like. Honking me right now over there in the shorts. <laughs> Must be in from, I don't know, somewhere a lot colder like Michigan or something. <laughs> right, so let's see if we can tell some more dad jokes here. Uh, we're horsing around. Uh, dad jokes? Yeah, or horse jokes? Jokes. <laughs> tell a Mr. Ed joke? Mr. Ed. Oh, Mr. Ed. <laughs> oh, there, boss. Sign up for this Here's the wagon back here. The crates of the beer. Okay. I think they just about have the horses fully hooked up. Yeah. They still need a driver for the horses. Is this one of those keyless ignitions, Rod? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Crowd is still actually building, I think, since when I looked last time. Tons of people out here. Yeah, they are, John. They are really cool, and they are some beautiful horses for sure. Never really stood out this close to them before. Didn't realize how big they were. So now they're getting everything else all finished, strapped up. 
still don't have a driver yet for the horses. I guess it'd be a driver. Would it be a driver? Would it be a pilot? I mean, who's guiding them? Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and get this shut down right now, but jump over to uh, J.O. and the party source reviews. He still has the video going as well. And then he has some more of the footage. So we should see these horses taking off here for a little bit, get a little bit of a trot around. If they do, I may pop back up with some more video at that point. Thanks for everybody that watched. Catch you guys later. All right, I will meet you.